One of the most requested features uh, for Atom SQ and Studio One is the ability, while you're in the pattern editor, uh, to go through and adjust things like velocity, repeat, delay, and probability. Well, in Studio One 5.2, now that's possible. So you'll notice here on screen that I have uh, the step automation uh, showing. You can do that by clicking this little automation lane icon right here. Um, and you'll see that the kicks are pretty much all the same velocity right now. But um, in order to go through and change this, all I have to do from Atom SQ is press and hold a step. And you'll notice on the screen we have velocity, repeat, delay, probability, and it says knobs five through eight. So this means that knob five right here is actually gonna go through and adjust velocity. Yay, I can do this one. Make that a little bit louder. Um, go to the next page here, select that one and then change that one as well too. You'll also notice on screen, it shows velocity or whatever you're controlling briefly there. So let's say, um, let's find this snare right here. And I wanted to look at repeat. So I do have to mouse over here to step automation to see that. You'll see there's a zero repeat, zero repeat over here. Um, once again, if I press and hold and change this, you'll see that the repeat actually uh, changes. So same goes for probability and delay. Uh, you can really use delay to create some uh, pretty interesting feels and either uh, drag behind the beat or play ahead of the beat. Um, so yeah, definitely you can go through, hold a pad and go through and adjust it. Uh, there is another way to do this, although um, all you have to do is make sure you're in the editor and then you can navigate over here to page number three. Now, once you're here on page number three, uh, we can go through here and select a pad. So it's kind of like latching to it. Um, and then you just select what you want to edit over here. So let's say we had velocity selected. Uh, I can go through here and change velocity or I can change repeat and change the repeat value, uh, delay, positive or negative, uh, as well as probability here, which is the probability that it's actually going to play that particular uh, step. So two ways to do it. You can either be on pages one or two of the editor, press and hold, use a knob, great for real time uh, playing, or you can navigate to page three here select a pad and then edit it using the screen and the uh, encoder by the screen as well too. Once again, this is all brand new to Studio One 5.2.